from Crema Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Conmere Report. Equipment manufacturer John Deere recently added to its local portfolio its newly redesigned and improved 460E2 articulated dump truck. Building on the success of the previous generation 460E platform, the new dump truck offers numerous improvements to cater for increased usability and serviceability for South African mining clients. John Deere South Africa articulated dump truck engineer Ian Marshall speaks to Crema Media's Donna Slater about the design improvements and what the new truck has to offer. The John Deere 460 um, competes in the 45 ton ADT class, which is obviously intermediate between the 40 and 50 class. Um, and this particular machine is the largest in the 45 ton class, with a bayload capacity of nearly a ton greater than the next largest machine in the competitors. The design was, was very well researched through the customer advocate group design process that Deere, John Deere does very well. Um, and they extensively research what uh, your customers and operators really want in an ADT. And they look at the existing product to, for inspiration as well as check out what the competitors are doing. And they go and design the machine with all those features. Um, and this machine does have some unique features that set it apart. The serviceability, um, no other machine has better serviceability than this machine. All services can be conducted at ground level. You do not have to climb up on any stairs or platforms to get to anything. Everything can be done on ground level. So at the, at the front of, of the truck around the engine, the side covers open up, the front door opens up, the bonnet tilts up. And you can also bring the truck down to a lower level by pushing a button and the truck will drop down about 120 millimeters. So you can really get to all the components. Nobody else can do that. Then you've also got components like the axles. John Deere make their own axles uh, at a factory in the United States. Um, and these axles made by them called the Teammate 5 axle, uh, dedicated for a, to a, an ADT, which does a lot of long distance hauling fast hauling and got specific components to specifically uh, designed for that with its own, each axle has its own cooling and filtration system. Typically in South Africa we are a very much uh, mining and commodities based economy um, and of, of the yellow equipment, um, around 70% of yellow equipment goes into mining operations um, and ADTs are very popular in the sector, um, often employed in the manganese around um, the Northern Cape, um, the coal mines of Mpumalanga, um, and the platinum mines um, up in the Rustenburg and Northwest. John Deere first got involved with ADTs when they formed a strategic alliance with, um, with Bell Equipment back in 1999 and they started selling ADTs, John Deere branded ADTs around then. Um, a few years later, with the launch of the, of, of, of the D-Series, they began manufacture of the D-Series ADTs at their, one of their own factories in, in the United States. Um, it was a joint, joint venture, but in 2012, they launched their own E-Series trucks built at those American factories, um, and this is product we have today. That's Crema Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.